for the Make Code Minute today, what I want to talk about is using arguments inside of functions or creating functions that take a number of arguments uh, so that you can do some sophisticated things in little separate uh, modular blocks of code. So what you'll see here is I have a function that I called light function and it has three of these different arguments. I'll show you when you build a function by going to advanced and functions, I'll click make function. It says, okay, what do you want to name this thing? I'm going to give it a, a name, new func. Uh, and then you can start adding to it things like, oh, I'm going to have a parameter for something that I have to type in in text, like the name uh, of, of an object. I can have a, a Boolean argument, true or false, and I can have numbers, integer numbers. Um, so I did that to create this function. And then you can see when it gets called, when this function is called somewhere else in the code, uh, I'm going to be including something called color, which is actually a string, uh, pixels, which is a number, and brightness, which is a number. Uh, when this function runs and we get to the good part here in this for loop, we're going to run through all of the pixels on the Circle Playground Express from 0 to the number of pixels that was argue, the, the argument or the parameter was set for. So if I say light function, tell it a color, red, uh, pixels 4 and brightness 20, then it's going to run through and do this from pixels 0, 1, 2, and 3. That's why I'm subtracting 1 because the, the 0 indexing requires that. Uh, and then I sort through whatever string came in with the function. And if the name matches one of these strings, red, blue, or green, then I'm going to use the corresponding colors. Uh, if it doesn't match that, then I'll just display black. So here's, here it is in uh, practice when I press the A button. It is going to call the light function with the string red. The number of pixels is six and the brightness is five. When I touch this B button, it's only two pixels. Uh, whoop, yeah, B button. Uh, two pixels, they're blue, and it's at 100% brightness. When I touch the A3, we get all of the pixels, 10, uh, set to green with a brightness of 20. And then just for uh, the example here of a string that it doesn't know what to do with, if I, if I press A2, it doesn't do anything because I'm sending the name Larry, and that doesn't match any of these strings in this uh, conditional uh, statement here. So that is how you can pass a number of different parameters or arguments to a function inside of make code. And that is your Make Code Minute.